Are we on? Oh, hi. Yeah, we're on. hi. Oh. Okay, I hope you guys. Oh, oh well, look oh. down, Periscope. Jesus. <laughs> I hope you guys remember me. This is Psychic Tracy Brown coming to you today from. Live from New York. It's Saturday night. Oh, Don't no. say that. We can't it. steal that. It's just, it's just a joke. Oh, no. No joking allowed. Obviously, okay. we can't. How are we going to steal it? I'm not even in New York. This is crazy. Like this. Is... Try not to shake the table. Oh, okay. Now, I don't know if you guys remember. Oh I God. did quite a few videos the other day about... Uh, we, uh, I'm, I'm a psychic. We do re reviews on hot topics. Mm -hmm. on, the, on YouTube, the third idea. I really, really hope you guys like it. Um, we have YouTube videos. Now, I also do it with Sean. I do a set by myself. You guys saw that. But I also do it with Sean. And this is called the third eye view, mm -hmm. which means it's a, another opinion on the same topic. So, well, hi guys. Third eye view fans, hi. Sorry this is that you Sean had to Little. sit through all that weird intro and that we can't landscape it because we're on Periscope, but it's okay. It's okay. Now try not to shake it. Okay, well. Then... I was doing fine with these videos yesterday. And today it's your, shaking. You're all by yourself. That's true. That's true. And I mean, like, we have to like go in and out of the feed. We want to just be like we're like waving in and out. Like, look at that. I'm, I'm, I'm not in it. You know, there I am. Peekaboo! It's like a peekaboo. <laughs> I'm just gonna go do my reading over here, and then I'm gonna pop back in. And <laughs> oh wait, wait, wait! We also need to time it. It's been my problem lately. Oh, this Periscope yeah. doesn't have a timer on. It's so annoying. Periscope. Periscope needs to fix this. There's a couple of Periscope things I don't needs to like. Be landscape. Landscape. Periscope. We need. We need a timer. Mm -hmm. Hello, yeah, this Periscope. Is like what is this? A Vine app? Like, come on. I don't know what it is. Okay, so let me put it for 13 minutes. Okay. Because then we upload this to YouTube. Yes, we will. You know. And the lighting's horrible. I hate the lighting. Yeah, well, this, this is your choice. We're doing Periscope. Well, because Periscope is fun. Okay, it's just it's done, it's you just push in more, or I'm going to push in more. I don't know what to do. Move I mean, in more. Like and we argue like this all the time. Well, we got to be. We were like, what, the, what are we? Like, what's like, jeez. <laughs> okay, so let me also add that... Sean loves to do anything gay. Oh, excuse me. Okay. Excuse you. Yeah, well, okay. What the hell? I mean, I do, but I mean, but, but it's. I have to stop him half the time. Okay, like, and also out being all transgender the is not gay. I mean, yes, they're in our community, oh, but I they're, didn't not, mean like, it they're that not way. Like, I, not, you know I, me. I get confused. I don't. Okay. I, he likes to do anything LGBT. LGBT. He likes that stuff. Per preferably just the gay and the LGBT. Like, I mean. <laughs> If we, do Ellen, if we do everybody. Ellen, I don't care. That's fine. You She's like to out people. I don't, but yeah, but I, mean, I don't really care if you're a lesbian. I'm not going to, like, care. Um, and, I mean, LGBT I like, means yeah. everyone. I know, but I like oh, to but focus... but I talked about I, Raven I like, Simone like being to, a lesbian. I like to focus on the gay of the LGBT because I'm a gay. No, but you I have wanna, to focus on everybody in LGBT. Out, I always want to sniff out the other homo men out there. Oh. Like Nick Jonas. Oh. Mm. Nick is not gay. He's dating, um, what's her name? Hadid. Gigi Hadid now. Yeah, okay. That sounds like a perfect beard. He's not... Oh, my God. See? He, they don't know this about you. This is how we talk privately. He wants everybody to be gay. He wants my grandson to be gay. Uh, and my grandson second. is a I precious you, little baby. I told you that your grandson was gay. And <laughs> you even affirmed that when I said, so, yeah. have, you, have, you already, have you already caught him playing in your shoes? Like, oh, I am. Yeah. <laughs> not okay. eating her shoes. Not, like, trying to, no. <laughs> in, in the shoes. Like trying, to walk, trying to walk around in, in the heels. Okay, in any case, hi Periscope. Hi. We are going to do a psychic review on Caitlyn on... Jenner and see what's going to happen post trans. I did one already on her, and I of course thought that she was going to be like moving into acting and stuff, and I think that's part of the. And movie. I want to see that too. So <laughs> let's let's get into. Oh, by the way, I'm not a psychic anymore. I am an angelic advisor. Period. That's my title, and I'm sticking to it. <laughs> She's a divine interpreter. Yes. I, I Wait. I'm a divine interpreter that receives messages from above. That's what my business cards are going to say. Mm -hmm. I'm redesigning them now. Kate, Caitlin Jenner, talk to me, Caitlin. How are you? Caitlin, talk to me. What's going to happen with your career? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine... I think I should have a set time to do 
the uh, periscopes like it's a news feed every day at the same hour. That sounds good, right guys? For position here. What? Uh huh? Yeah! A thing. I thought, see, I saw the last time I drew the cards that she was gonna lead into like wanting to be an actress. Mm -hmm. And she wants to go into the entertainment world, and that's best represented by this. The follow me card is all about like transitioning into a whole new world, mm -hmm. but it's not the training world that I see. This is like the entertainment industry, like, you know what I mean? This follow me card represents like an agent. Like, if she like she wants to find like an agent, like, I remember seeing that the last time. Mm -hmm. You know what I mean? And then, um, working with other women and stuff like that, and it's all about like. Definitely working with other women without uh -huh. a doubt. Yeah. Um, I have to be honest with you. I think Caitlyn is still conflicted in this process. I think she's conflicted about her sexuality. Oh my God! Yes! Because it's been said that she became a tranny. I mean, she, I'm sorry, she just became a woman to date other women, but the Keeper of Secrets card reveals that maybe she might be attracted to men. Okay, what I see... That's what I see. Okay, what I see is that there is going to be a woman that's going to beard for him first. Mm -hmm. For her. It's a, oh, for her, it's a cover-up. It's, it's... You, I promise you're going to be like, Caitlyn has a girlfriend. Though, right, because she has his, her penis. Uh, penis. Right, penis. but she still... It's, it's a fine gray area of, I have my penis, and... Am I gay? Yes. So there's a girl that's going to come to the table that's going to be his significant other because of the penis factor. Mm -hmm. It's a cover-up. Yeah, but I see Shimmer. She's living for herself. But then again, the Midnight Prince card, which is something I remember drawing the last time, which is about making dreams come true. And again, it all draws back to, I think, acting. And then again, when drawing come, future come, come. when drawing future cards, the, the idea of her future shows me in the next couple of months she's going to start a process of new beginnings and endings, like projects, like when you're on a movie or on a TV show. I really feel like part of the reason why she became a woman was to be And to I totally believe that. I'm actually seeing something totally different. Oh. But... Well, because I see the sexuality oh, issue. Oh, you're out. That's what I like. Oh, that's yeah. what the cards are showing me uh -huh. that there's a real big juggle with this woman that's going to come to the table, uh -huh. but she's hiding the real affair mm -hmm. with possibly someone else. I don't know what you're just saying. And he's younger. I said he. I said what is he? He's, he's, but the woman comes through first. Uh huh. And the woman's first. like, oh, I'm yeah, his. The lover's card. Yeah, but the lover's card in this case. Usually something else is in the middle, um, and it's a young, a young, very vibrant guy. Maybe that's what this is. Maybe he is. Ooh, maybe he's, he's sexy. Man, Look at his. Yes. Mm. Yes. 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 <laughs> <laughs> so, so funny. look at this. Look at this. Lovers. He's gonna be in love with somebody. It's gonna be the greatest love of his life. He has to hide it. Mm -hmm. oh, so Look, yeah, secrets. I got secrets. Secrets. Too, secrets. Greatest love of his life. And he can't say that he is yeah, in a Yeah, this is something you have to keep in the thoughts about. The catch, me, the catch me card shows not walking off the ledge publicly. Right. But this woman is going to cover up. But he wouldn't up. be in a gay relationship if he was dating a man because of what they're trying to do. They become... They're technically oh, I don't know the whole story. The public's not going to understand that. You have a very unique perspective on the on the world. The, the public's not going to... The public's going to be like me. Okay, well, technically, it's not a gay relationship. Okay, there you Trinies go. Trinies become the other... The, the other, the opposite sex to people. They find... They view themselves as heterosexuals trapped in their own body. Usually. That sounds a little weird because he's saying that he's still a woman. Potato the woman. I don't, I don't care. Okay. And he's still kept his penis, so... I don't but... Know. But, you know, you have to keep your penis because... I do know this. Tranny chasers, <coughs> mm -hmm. like Chinese, they like all, they like the parts to be. They like both parts. <coughs> so most Chinese chasers don't want their Chinese mate to to it's, cut it off because they like it. I'm completely I've met, overwhelmed I've met now. A tranny, I mm -hmm. met a Chinese who had a boy. 
hot, hot beefy mouth in them. <laughs> and she was the one who would be sticking it to him. Oh, God. I, I'm overwhelmed. I can't I can't do. Me. Oh, let's can stop. Can you imagine being let's like, no, like stop. a girl stop. with stop. food? It's so weird of me. Oh, I'm an angelic advisor, and you're educating me on all this good stuff. Well, angels aren't going to save you here, honey. You're down with the demon. <laughs> <laughs> God wants me to know all you these things all because you I want, but do readings in, on everyone. You're in the, you're in the double and hell pit and the double. God needs me to know everything so I could do readings on trannies, gays, lesbians, oh, the whole gamut. So I'm doing these readings because it's very important for me to stay present and available, especially for love. Yeah. Anyway, <laughs> but I still see Caitlin moving into wanting to be real, a real actress. I think she wants to get out of reality TV, and I think she wants to get cast for, like, you know, romantic comedies. I think she wants to have her notebook movie and stuff. So, moving on, I do get the world card, which means on a world stage, uh -huh. next to the Illuminator card, which is a resounding yes, she is going to be a star. Uh -huh. See? Is. I uh -huh. See? totally agree. Why come out on Vanity Fair in such a huge theatrical way if you didn't want to She's push gonna into, show up into movies and be Very, theatrical. very dramatic as a right. woman. Uh -huh. And it's like gonna she be... wants to be a Meryl Streep. That's what she wants. Yeah. Like, Which when she too. goes down in history, she yes. wants that star. She wants the Oscar. She wants... She wants oh, my it. God. She wants the she wants Oscar. Oscar. Yes. And she wants that star. Uh -huh. And she wants it to say Caitlyn Jenner. And Actress. she wants to be... Yes. And she wants to be booyah in your face. Like, she really wants to just nail people. Mm -hmm. <laughs> I did this. Yeah. I created history. Yeah. As the first, like, Oscar-winning... Gay. No. Tranny. Tranny. Gender. Not gay. Yeah. Ah, keep, woman, yeah. Forgive me. I don't know that's the difference. Not, I'm look, learning. Like, look at the Vanity Fair spread. Of course. Like, that's, like, that's, celeb that's celebrity status. That's what... Yeah. Sense. Okay. Hey Although, guys. You know what? I would totally, if I, if I was at that age, I would transition myself too just to be a Meryl Street. Man, Meryl Street's fuck yeah. Okay. Or Kate Blanchett. Yes. Hey guys, Sean and I work at the Green Man store. Call us for your own personal readings. 818-985-2010. 818-985-2010. We're you enjoyed psychics. I'm an angelic, um, angelic. 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 <laughs> Angina advisor. advisor. <laughs> I'm an angelic advisor. advisor, and Sean is a fairy interpreter. Uh, uh -huh. I'm a fairy translator. I guess <laughs> fairy I'm translator. Mm -hmm. Thanks, guys. We might do mo one more reading. So, but thanks for tuning in. Take it easy. Bye. Bye. What are all these people joining?